WTFNN. Headline News Update. Basil Chapman, those are the target ignitions hour, noon to 1 p.m. Eastern Time, and we were looking at the 1 p.m. update. Down minus 11 at 27,809, dropped all the way down this morning to the 27,700 area, trading over 100 points higher now. It held the 14 period moving average. This is the digestive phase we've been talking about for three days now. Um, and yes, there should be some, some rally attempt. And the big thing is how does the Dow handle the 27,000, if it can get there, 27,980? to the 28,010 area. That's going to be key. Does it break above it? Does it stall and make an H pattern and start coming down again? The S&P is coming back as well. And that is down now two and a half at, um, let me check that out, 3106, SPX, .X, there it is. And uh, it too held the 14 period moving average. And um, same kind of pattern, but the MACD has already turned down. Stochastic is holding well at 88%, but pulling back. And we're going to be watching this. It needs to hold 33,088, 3,086. That area has to be key support next week. Otherwise, it goes deeper. And if you look at the QQQ, the 1, 2, 3, that's the NDX 100 uh, trust series. You're looking at down 48 cents at 201.67. Uh, also made that six highest peak in the Chapman wave, the peak seven, a uh, peak F at 203.84, holding quite nicely here. But the MACD has turned down stochastics at 87 percent. I like it over 80 percent, but it's starting to pull back. So watch, watch closely for next week. It mustn't close under 199.30, and at this particular point, it could even bounce to the 203.17 area. If it goes above there, that's going to be very good. If it stalls, it got to watch out. I just want to do gold quickly because gold was pulling back earlier on. It's down almost nine at 14.46, stuck in a range. It's just, it's just, it needs time. It had a spectacular move up. I think it needs more time. And the dollar, the dollar was holding okay, not great, but it was holding okay. It's up five ticks at 97.96. Yeah, it's it's holding in a range. But the weekly chart says consolidation is still going on. And crude oil had a spectacular move. Crude oil is up 2.12 percent. Up a dollar twenty-two, fifty-eight twenty-two. That whole fifty-nine area. If it breaks above fifty-nine, something is going on. Crude oil. If it suddenly pulls back, you got to watch fifty-four support. Have a wonderful day. Stay tuned for Steve Rhodes, for Dave White, Tom O'Brien, and I will see you tomorrow. And traders.